Hello everyone and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. We're now on episode 3 where we are now going to be taking down the giant snake. Hello big boy. Oh, hang on, I need to... Go to the data center, so we need to go this way data now. Data should be straight ahead. I guess Farrell's gonna have to find another way there. Oh, what's this? Oh, I just did a smash. that because that's going to be too big. Hang on. Um. Okay. Uh, come on. Up we go. Once I get the backup, I can reboot Gaia, fix the system, heal the blight, restore Elizabeth's dream. Is it still there? Okay. here. Aloy? The goddess. There is no goddess. I told you that already. That's not Gaia. That's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. Ugh. <sighs> 
I got it. Farrell, I'm sorry. You have a sharp bite sometimes, you know? But it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin. The thing is, um, there's going to be more of that. I'm out of leads, Farrell. But I, I have to keep searching. And fast, and whatever risks I have to take, I will. And it doesn't make sense to have someone with me. Someone who might get hurt. This is on me, Farrell. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world, things no one else understands. And he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone, Varl. I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure, but Spymaster Murad back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? Varl, I... <sighs> Come on, it might work. Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces again. <laughs> okay, I... I guess it's worth a shot. We've got a long walk ahead. Actually... I've got a better idea. Interesting. Meridian has returned. You earned this welcome. You saved them. Not yet. In the name of the Sun King of Vard, a royal welcome for the champion. Big way. Murad, Aloy has an urgent matter to discuss. Dashain, that makes two of us. I've sent forth hunters for weeks. The sun fall all the way to the sacred land, searching for you. Something happened at the spire. Come. I'll show you. Watch your step. You saved us all, to be sure, but uh, we're still cleaning up the mess. It happened right after the solstice. We were able to explain it away, thank the sun. Otherwise, it might have caused a panic. That is one interesting structure. One night, for less than half a minute, it glowed an angry red. From Meridian, it looked like a trick of the light. But those who were closer, atop the light, said it could not have been a reflection. Much to my dismay, they said the light rose up from the tower's base. From that. We left everything just as it was. What do you think happened? I don't know. The Spire's supposed to send out signals, messages, for the terraforming system. But Hades tried to use it to wake up ancient war machines. I was sure I got the connection to that thing. Wait here while I check it out. Let us know what you find. All right. I've got a bad feeling about this. I don't know. I could pull this thing out of the box. What? He couldn't. 
something was transmitted from the top of the spire. I guess I have to find a way up there. Okay, whoops, hang on. Um, okay, I need to get up to the spire, but how? Okay. Jump to that ledge behind me. Okay. Hmm. Eh. No. Right. Hmm. Hmm. Where do I need to go? See you. Look at you. Should be able to jump back and reach those ropes behind me. What? Um. No, damn it. Um. No, I need to. I grab no, hang on. Ah, okay, we got it. Okay. Ah shit. Okay, hang on. I kind of fucked it up. Hang on. Be able to get up there now. No. I thought Silence was helping me when he gave me his lens. <laughs> it looks like he tricked me. He transmitted something through the spire. Did he save Hades? Ah, shit. <laughs> Damn it. How would he do that? Well, if I can figure out where he sent it, I can track him down. Okay, now I'm gonna start oh, all over again. The top will tell me. Um. Right, now I'm gonna go back up here again. No, no, hang on. I can keep climbing this way. Okay. <laughs> it 
looks like this panel's ajar. Can I go up through the inside? Um. Oh. I see you finally figured it out. To be honest, I'm surprised it took you so long to discover my rules. You read the lands to steal Hades. How could you be so reckless? Reckless? You're the one who tried to purge Hades before its precious knowledge could be... extracted. The mysterious signal that woke it, for example. Or why don't one of those Gaia backups you've been having such a hard time finding? If you knew, why didn't you just tell me? I've been having problems of my own these past six months, Eloy. The difference is, I've made progress. So once your anger at my entirely necessary deception has faded, why don't you come out here and find me in the Forbidden West and learn all that I've discovered? Oh, I'll come find you, all right. Yes. Well, the coordinates make it simple enough. Even for you. Sighted, and it transformed, almost like the day of the battle. I can only be grateful that it's a stormy day. Few will have seen the tower change from Meridian. What did you discover? Hades. The danger didn't end here. It went into the Forbidden West. And I have to follow. I see. That can be difficult. The West is called Forbidden for a reason. A tribe of ferocious warriors controls much of it. The Tanakh. They allow no trespassers past its border. That said, under the Sun King of Art, a fragile peace has been negotiated, and indeed, the next embassy will take place in a day or two on the edge of the frontier. Were you to attend the gathering under his auspices, the Tanakh might grant right of passage instead of hunting you and attacking on sight. Great. Just what I need. More killers. Ah, the Sun King. Aloy, it's good to see you. You left in such haste. We never had a chance to properly thank you. Can, can we show the champion the spear now, please? It's a min. Quiet. It's true. We bear gifts. Decorum usually calls for a ceremony of offering at the palace. 
But I thought you would prefer a less formal occasion. Bring them, please. A Avad, this is all very kind, but I... Uthit. Vinasha. Quick. Better hand them over before she runs off again. Really? Must you? Interesting. Okay. Try it on. That's beautiful. On behalf of all the citizens of the Sundom, may these tokens remind you of our eternal gratitude. Perhaps you'd like to spend more time with your friends. Come speak to me when you're ready to depart. Cool. I need to attach the master override to my new spear. Should be a workbench around here I can use. Okay, I need to go up there. There, a workbench. Nice. Okay, master override installed. Plus, something new to store up and release energy. A uh, resonator should help in a fight. Okay. Think of it. What happened to that hammer you lost? Return to Maraden thing. Oh, is that a statue of me? Are you ready to go? Or do you need a little more time? I better get going. And if I'm headed west, it sounds like I'll need rite of passage from the Tanakh, as you said. Where exactly is this embassy going to be held? Past the Daunt, the canyon that marks the western border of the Sundom. You'll find the fortress of Baron Light at its farthest edge. The embassy will take place just beyond its gates. It's a long march, a fortnight on foot. A couple of days hard riding should get us there. Actually, it might be better to rest here tonight. Head out in the morning. Of course. I'll arrange it. Oh, he's a sleepy boy. Oh. 
sparks to steal. Ha! Never seen anyone use one of those to get around. Is that how I get to Baron Light? Uh, yes, I mean, usually, but not today. Uh, not yet. And why is that? Well, the Daunt. The whole valley. It's infested with machines. I can handle machines. Oh, I'm sure you can, but uh, I'm under strict orders not to operate until the whistle down at Chain Scrape sounds the all clear. Look, I didn't come all this way just to stand around and wait. I'll crank that car down myself if I have to. Well, but then... who would crank it back up? <laughs> fine, fine. Though, should anyone ask, it might be best to say you forced me. Oh, wow. I see smoke, but not a lot of activity. Smoke's probably coming from something the machines wrecked. As for the quiet, well, there's a work stoppage in effect because of all the fuss. What sort of machines are causing the trouble? <laughs> Nasty ones, and lots of them. Bristlebacks, they're called. The strangeness is, they're not native to the Dodge. Just showed up. All of a sudden. No hunters to kill them? Well, we've got hunters, just none that want to cross Olvent. Boss of Chain Scrape. He is self-appointed. Work stoppage was his idea. Yeah, well, I'm just passing through. Got an embassy to attend. You should have said that ain't gonna happen no time soon. What are you talking about? Hear that? That's your answer. Who is that? Karja's son priest. Cranked him down yesterday, about an hour before the machine trouble started. He's a very important man, or so he says. That embassy at Baron Light? He's the one supposed to run it! Ah! Great. If you don't do as I say immediately, the Sun King himself shall hear of your insolence. Thanks to you, I was forced to spend the night shivering in the tent. Exposed to attack, I might have died. Oh, me you refuse to transport, but not this... This... What? This Nora girl? This savage? Aside, Scallywag. Wadis. That's Aloy. Studious Wadis. Aloy? You know, savior of Meridian? Really? Well, that lessens the insult, I suppose. <laughs> I came here for the embassy at Baron Light. The way I hear it, so did you. Well, not with the valley infested. And so did Aramon proclaim the sun priests most precious and worthy of safekeeping. See, scripture. I shall head to Baron Light when the captain of the Vanguard tells me the way is clear, and not a moment sooner. Fine. Captain's a friend of mine, you know? Where is Erend? Wouldn't mind speaking to someone a little more action, a little less... scroll. Wadis. Studious Wadis. Studious. Wadi sent Aaron and another vanguard out at daybreak to clear the way. And so at daybreak. Hey! Shh. <laughs> Down the valley then? Yeah, said they check the ruins on the left bank for tracks. Take it from there. Okay. I hear there's a work stoppage. Any way to upgrade my gear? I'll bet the Smith and Chain Scrape would let you use his workbench. As for the bristlebacks, you might want to craft some acid arrows. Hitting their canisters with those will take them down quick. Thanks. I'll find Aaron, and I'll bring him back. Hey! Where do you think you're going? What, to the top of the ridge? To wait in safety? 
Sorry. Operator's under strict orders. No passengers till the whistle blows, right? That's right. <laughs> Best start cranking. <laughs> Why? Why? Jorf, would you kindly escort Studious to Chain Scrape and wait for me there? You got it. I will find Erend, and I will help clear a path. But after that, no more excuses. Baron Light. Embassy. If such be the will of the sun. It will be. Trust me. All right. So that has concluded episode three of the game. So thank you for tuning in, ladies and gentlemen. And I'll see you in our next adventure. Bye for now.